huge responsibility. Hard enough to raise a child. Those of us who've done it will tell you it's harder, though, if you have to say, hey, who is the father of my baby? And even worse, if you have to say, which guy is the father of my baby? Sherry is here today because she wants to know. And here's the story. I know JR is the father of my child and refuses to take responsibility. And he even married my good friend. Sherry's a liar, and I know that I'm not that baby's father. I don't see why Sherry keeps insisting that this is JR's baby when she told me herself that she did not think this was JR's baby. Okay. Do you think that this child is now how old? She's five and a half years old. What's her name? Shania Aguilar. Shania, okay. Who is the father of Shania who is almost six years old? Who's the father? J.R. Roop. You're sure of it? Yes, I am. There's not a doubt in your mind that this man's the father? No, there is not. Is he paying child support? He was until he started working under the table so they wouldn't garnish his checks. How many years of child support did he pay? Maybe two if I was lucky. How much is he behind? Um, about four years. Four years? How much money is that? <laughs> a ton, right? A ton, exactly. But can I tell you how it all started? Yes. Why? Tell me why you think he's the father. Well, we were together for three years. How could he not be the father, for one thing? Then, what happened is I moved to Colorado. Three, year, three months after we were there, he moved me and his family, which is mom and dad, and took us to Oklahoma. I was there with him for three years, and just like any other relationship, you know, we had our ups and downs, but I guess we couldn't get along. So, you know, we went separate places is what we did. Okay. So I moved in with a co-worker of mine. Okay. So I can get back home. Two weeks later, okay, I'm talking to Amy, which is my, was my friend at that time. And I was talking to her, and I was telling her, well, I'm, I might be pregnant. And then so my co-worker took me down to one of the clinics up in Oklahoma to get us. I took the pregnancy test and it was positive. So I tell Amy and Amy's all excited and all, and she was young then, you know, just like any other younger teenager. She's 10 years younger than you and your, uh, than you and JR, is that correct? That's right. Okay. Okay, then what happened is I got a hold of JR and me and Amy were together and I told him I'm pregnant and he was excited. Okay, because it took me so long to get pregnant. Okay. So then we're all there and we're talking and I told him, well, what are we going to do? And he goes, well, if it's mine, I'm going to take care of it. I said, okay. You know, then he tells me, well, I think you need to go to Colorado to live with your mom. You don't need the stress because me and his parents didn't get along all that good. So he moves me back up there with my mom. I'm up there with my mom in Colorado and he stays and says that he'll be up there a month to two months later. I never see him. I'm getting phone calls, and I'm hearing that he's cheating on me. I hear all this other stuff. So what am I supposed to think sitting there being pregnant? He's telling me he loves me, and if he loves me, he wouldn't be cheating on me. All right, it's time to meet Jr. and Amy. Come on out. Sorry, that's a bunch of bull you know, don't you? Why don't you be a man and sit down? What is she lying about? She's lying about all the stuff about her uh, saying that she's that I haven't been taking responsibility. I shouldn't take responsibility. She doesn't even know if the child is That's right. Or I not. Have, there was no there was no proof that the baby was mine. You know what, Jr. Yes, there was because you well, went right was. to the Stop. hospital. Oh, was that right? You took me to the hospital Stop. and you said, "Okay, we're going to see how far along you are." Sherry, you tell me. You tell me how the baby can be mine. We were together for three damn years. Yeah, and three years. Yeah, yeah. Baby, and we never had a baby before baby until you moved in. And all of a sudden, you come up pregnant with my baby. That was a Mary, you were right, sit you back. Can't have kids. Sit back. Have a baby? Wait, sit back and let me understand something. You've had a baby with her, yes. then yes. you can have a baby with her. Exactly. She's fertile and you're fertile because you've had a baby, you're right? Exactly right. Okay, so let's start with that. You were court ordered to pay child support? No. 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 You've been paying. I've never I've never I've never been to court. They've garnished they've, wages. They've garnished my wages. Well, well, can I explain? If they've garnished your wages, but I've never that been means that the law has said you are the father. Is that correct? They're, they're not garnishing they're our producer's wages. He's not the father. Well, yeah, that's true. That's true. But they determined me as the father. What? They determined me as the father. Yeah, there was no. There was no right. proof. They never said nothing. Let me ask you a question. Are you the father? No, I'm not. Why? Because we. Because she was. We were Three damn years, and she and and yeah, she becomes and you, after two you, months. Uh, of 
held with us. <laughs> You're being hurry, Amy. You know, it was a long time ago. You weren't cheating on him with okay, me. Okay, wait a minute. What you just said makes no sense. If you have fathered a child, yes. and she has mothered a child, both of you are fertile, and you could have a child. Just because you didn't have one in three years doesn't mean you can't have one tomorrow. And I'm Sherry's husband. Okay. Okay. Man, if you don't want responsibility, that's fine. You have a beautiful five and a half year old little girl. If you don't want her, Prove it. I, I'll it. take her. If I'll nothing, if nothing, if nothing, if come back here. You, you are so sure that J.R. is the father, correct? Yes, I am. Did you sleep with anybody else around the time you could have gotten pregnant? Yes, I did one time and it was the biggest mistake of my life. But when I went, like I was saying, when I went with wait, wait, him... Wait, 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 I don't care whether it was a psychological <laughs> mistake. I'm only interested in the physical aspects. At the time you got pregnant, you were sleeping with somebody else? No, no, that's not how it happened. We yes, broke up. Was. You Wait. brought him to my house. Be quiet. This is none of your business. It, it is my business. It's none of your business. I don't care. We need him. We have all the intercourse. You don't want him. You know why? You're taking money from my baby. I believe that is my business. Okay, wonder if Shania is his baby. If it is, then he can be a man and take care of it like a man should. But until you prove that she is mine, then I'm not going to give you Now, because Let's understand something. Sherry, you yes. are very sure. I want to just get one thing clear that's really bothering me. Okay. You are sure that JR is the father. The state has been making JR, JR pay, yes. pay because he is the father, or so the state claims. Right. However, at the time you got pregnant, you were indeed sleeping with someone else. Would you explain to me why there's no possibility that the other guy is the father? Because when we went down to the hospital, which it was me and JR, they told them exactly when the baby was conceived, how far along I was, and also and when the baby matters. was that's, due. That doesn't matter either because the times never matched. Sherry, if you did sleep with someone else at okay. the time that you conceived, how do you know that JR is the father and not the other guy? Give me your reason. Use the condom. For Fair enough, and you didn't with J.R.? No, I was with him for three years. I should have. He's sleeping around all the time. There's no telling what he would have You never me. slept with the other guy around that time and did not use a condom. No. You always no. used a condom yes. at that time. I only slept with him once. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> well, I stay the night with you. Just because you sleep in a bed with somebody doesn't mean you have to open your legs for him. Uh, <laughs> that's the way you look at it. <laughs> What are you going to do when it's not my baby? Okay. Jump for joy. Jump yeah. for joy. I'm going to jump for joy. Jump for joy, baby. Yes. You are the one. Oh, I am? Have you seen my little boy? No, you haven't. You know what? Our son is very well taken care of. Jarrah loves it with all of his heart. Anything that that baby needs, Jarrah is right there for it. And you're going to tell me he's not a very good dad? Let's calm down. We can find out definitively who really is the father. Yeah, the father. I want if it is Jr., what do you want to do about it? I will what take responsibility. No, I don't want him in her life. Okay, if it is not Jr. and it's this person, what are you going to do about that? Well, I've already discussed it, and he would sign over all the papers so my husband can adopt her. Okay, so that's where we are. We'll be right back. Sheree wants to know once and for all if LeBron is the father of her 11-year-old son. I don't want to know. I know he's the father of my son, and I just want him to step up to the plate and do what it is he's supposed to do as a man. He says... He says he 
has been paying child support. Um, that is correct. Back in uh, 94, 95, I gave um, LeBron three opportunities to come to court. He never showed up one time. Um, finally, the judge was upset because he kept telling the judge he was going to show up, and he never showed up. So the judge was like, you know what? By default, you are the father, and therefore they started garnishing his check. Um, I've made it a point to keep in contact with him over the years because this is an open um, situation and it does need to br have closure to it. And um, this is the opportunity. Uh, his first response to me when I got in contact with him was, can I sign over parental rights? I said, no, you cannot. I said, this needs to be settled. So he gave me two days. Um, I live in Las, Las Vegas, Nevada. He gave me two days to come up with rent money, utility money, air flight money, hotel reservations. Um, to fly to San Jose, California to um, get the DNA test without my lawyer. So while I was there, I did not sign any forms or anything like that because I didn't have my lawyer, so I didn't know what I was going to be signing. So um, it's been me over the years that, ha that has kept in contact in with him. Is he in arrears? Is he in arrears? He's $60,000 in arrears. Wow. What does the state say about that? Um, basically, they are having him pay the child support. But he's sixty thousand dollars. He will be paying me until he is dead. <laughs> All right, LeBron had something to say about your accusations. Sheree, you refused to take the fraternity test at least twenty times. If you thought I was the father, you could have taken advantage of any of those times. You didn't have to try and ruin my life. Why did you refuse twenty times? He is lying, straight up lying. I have. Um, the court papers upstairs, I didn't know to bring, bring them right, here right, right. to show that I did have the court date scheduled and that he missed it every time. Um, LeBron does not want to take responsibility for his child. Um, you are absolutely sure, without a shadow of a doubt, that this man is the father. Well, the world could, could end, so I can't say that, but um, I am saying that um, I do believe that. Did you sleep with anyone? I'll ask you the same thing I asked mm -hmm. Sherry. Did you sleep with anyone else at about the time you conceived the child? No. This is the only guy you slept with? Yes. Okay, Besides come on. Besides my fiancé, yes. Wait a minute. Besides <laughs> my fiancé. Now, your fiancé has been tested, and he yes, is he not has. the father of the child. No, he is not. So the only two men you slept with were these two? That's right. And the other guy absolutely can't be the father, so it no. has to be this guy. It has to come be. Come on out, LeBron. First off, I want to say she's lying. Sheree's lying. I got proof right here. I got proof right here, like she said, from her own words, that I went on and I asked for a paternity test. From the day when the first you, kid... Why are you lying? LeBron, I had I three proof. court dates and you lie. never showed up to proof. a court date. I got proof. You never showed up to one I damn proof. court date. You know you why I didn't show up? Clown me I lived TV? in L.A. I don't think... I BS. lived in L.A. BS, she, LeBron. Can you stop let me lying. Talk? No, I'm not yeah. letting you, know you talk why? because you're lying. Because you know it's the truth. You know it's you're the truth. lying, LeBron. Let me tell you what happened. I was living in L.A. with my, you're my you're son. You're lying. You were living with your mother when I was, I was living staying in LA there. And your mother was dying of cancer. I stayed another... there, helped you with your you, mother, you're... helped you with your twin brother you... and your baby sister. You're going to hell for that line. No, you go to hell. Oh, my goodness. You go to hell. We're going to prove it tonight. Yeah, we We're going to prove it tonight. That's not the issue. The issue is 10 years you, you denied me no, a chance. No, you are a liar. You did years, not show up to court. Now, when we leave, I will... What has she denied you? To the chance to know if this kid is mine and be in this kid's life. Why you are a liar. You denied yourself by ignoring then your why, responsibility you as a man. I, okay. did, I refused because you gave me two There's days to get to San Jose and I was There's not going to sign anything LeBron. without my lawyer. There's why did you word. miss three court dates? Why did because you not you make the it? Notification why did you are a liar? You are a liar. I kept up with you from day one. Yeah, well, you didn't from day one, boy. And you can still get that trip with me. You better check your proof is in the LeBron, let me understand something. The court has asked you to pay child support, yes, correct? Yes, yes. Okay. Why did the court make you pay child support? Default, he, like she said. Because his butt because didn't because show up for three court days. Wrong. That's why. Wrong. So what wrong. kind of paper? You gave him the wrong whatever, address. LeBron, whatever, whatever, what no. kind of paper? I didn't think so. I don't, what I don't even know your address. What kind of paper did you bring? They found you, they sell. Just like they did when they gar started garnishing this, your this check. Is the point, this is the point I want to make. The point of the... The point of the matter is I have a letter from her admitting that she didn't want me to be the father. Okay? For five years she admitted. And then she played games. I have a letter admitting that. Number two, I have a letter saying that I told her all I wanted fraternity test. I never asked for her to sign any papers, you are lying, anything LeBron. but a fraternity test. You are lying. Are you the father? I don't know. Do you think you are? 
I don't think so. You had three times you wanted me to sign over my rights without my lawyer being there, and I was I not going to do it. I'm not a fool. That. I'm not but a fool. But I got proof here of what you said. The, I got the, proof here um, of what you said. Well, now, she claims that she slept with two men mm -hmm. around that time. Mm -hmm. One, her fiancé, he has taken a DNA. He is not the father she claims definitely. Right. That leaves you by default. There was no third man. No man. According okay. to what she said. Now, From our own after admission. 11 years Dealing of with a wondering, child, I been doing this with a poor man. child is going to learn the truth today, mm -hmm. okay? We'll be right back. And now, from our reaction room. I'm very mad that she had to, she waited 10 years to do this. And then she, she had to build up $60,000 of debt against me without sitting me down and saying, let's do this responsibly. If he is my child, then I'll step up to the plate. Here's another case, uh, 11 years. 11 years! That's how long Sheree has been waiting to find out who the father of her little boy is. Is it LeBron? Alan, LeBron's the father? Sally, LeBron is not the biological father. they give him his money back or you what? Know, I, I'm not a lawyer, Sally. I really don't know, but I will say this to you, LeBron. Why didn't you go to that court date the first three times? You would have had the $60,000 in your pocket instead of owing it. Okay. Yeah, I didn't go because have I didn't Sheree get come out here. She won't come out. All right. Who do we have next? Sherry and J.R. Now, there's no doubt in your mind it's J.R., right? Right. Okay. Alan is J.R. the father of Sherry's daughter. Sally, J.R. is not the biological yeah. father. Yeah. Yeah. So finally, finally we have a happy but ending. But he also there's, there's has another, been asked to pay... Person. Wait, this, this is, is the, the second either. time on this show he's been asked to pay child support, didn't show up for a court date, and they have him paying child support when he's not the biological parent. Now, I want you guys to listen to me. you got to take those little pieces of paper that Alan Gelb has. That's your ticket out of this. Do I get and a you, copy of that, you, too? Absolutely. Thank you. And you take it to the court, and you say, hello. Damn, Skippy. <laughs> Don't worry about that. I mean, you have and to then, do and, that. And, and then, Sally... And then, Sally, the second thing that they really need to do is they need to sit down and do a reality check for themselves as to why they're in all this drama to you begin with. You aren't kidding. Time to move on, folks.